Welcome back to another Lord of the Multiverse. Well, in the past, I've been telling you guys about the Theros block. I mean, it's recent. Everybody's been talking about it. But let's rewind the clock back to when I first started playing, and that is Ravnica, specifically the Dragon's Maze. The race for the mage. An ancient power is hidden among the streets of Ravnica, but in order to wield this power, the guilds must solve the twisting route through the landmarks and guild gates across Ravnica. The Implicit Maze. Niv Mizzet, the brilliant dragon who leads the League of Izzet, has set his mages to the task of discerning the proper route, and they are close to solving the maze. But Niv Mizzet's mysterious project has provoked such suspicion and anger that the other guilds have armed for a major conflict. Meanwhile, the secretive Demir, Guildmaster, has only served to fan the flame. As tensions rise, Niv Mizzet sees that the only way to prevent a destructive war is to invite the other guilds to run the maze as well. The race is on. The maze will only be completed when a single person runs the correct route through the maze, so each guild readies its champion. The ten maze runners race through the streets of Ravnica, employing their guilds characteristic strategy. The Selenesia use powerful nature elementals and other minions to stampede through the city and to defend their own guild gate. The Orzhov bribe their way through checkpoints while draining their enemies of resources. The Gruul rely on instinct and brute force, while the Demir on secrecy and deception, and the Azorius on the imposing law of magic on their competitors. With no guild pack to restrain the guilds, all spells and tactics are fair game. Few know the origin of the implicit maze or fully understand the prize that lies at its end, but Niv Mizzet and the planeswalker Jace Bellerin have begun to unravel its history. The maze was devised thousands of years ago by Azor, the original founder of the Azorius Guild and may have been intended as a test of the guild's ability to put aside their differences and cooperate. The mace traces through territory held by all ten guilds, implying that the guilds would have to collaborate to solve it, but instead each guild strives to outrace the others and crown its own champion the victor. The test of unity has become a race for supremacy. Which guild will prevail? And that concludes the story of the Dragon's Maze. Next time, I'm going to be focusing on another player in this block, Rao Zarek, the Planeswalker. But before I let you go, I'm going to tell you one big thing that you guys should be doing, and that is supporting One Mind Syndicate on our Patreon page. It only takes $1 a month, and that contribution will greatly affect you guys' lives, because you will be watching awesomeness, and your eyes will be crying with tears of pure joy. And this is the Sound Alchemist telling you guys to like, comment, and subscribe for more One Mind Syndicate goodness.